This segment of Good Company was paid for by Milano Monuments. When it's time to buy a headstone or memor a memorial for your family or a loved one, you know that you can just go to Milano Monuments. But Milano Monuments, they offer them so much more. They've got a religious gift store, offers a number of different gifts, books, videos for all ages. Well, here to tell us all about that is the owner of Milano Monuments, Jim Milano. Welcome back to the show, Jim. Thanks, Mike. Happy New Year. Nice. All right, uh, before we touch base on, on the gift store, you know, let's just again recap what Milano Monuments really is. I mean, because everyone knows of you for the, for the monuments and the headstones. So let's talk about that real quick. Well, it, it sincerely did all start with the monuments. My father started the company with my mother back in the 1960s, and um, our family has evolved into our new showroom. We're kind of fast forwarding. Right. But with that said, where we have really a full line of religious gift articles, um, we have also a very large selection in our showroom of cemetery memorials of all different sizes and shapes. All right, so, it, you know, and there's a lot going on in, in when it comes to funeral arrangements. So do you and your staff actually help families uh, of uh, the lost loved ones to actually put everything together, uh, it, like, li like literally from A to B or A to Z, because there's a lot that goes into actually planning a funeral? Yeah, we, we don't get involved so much with the funeral side, but there has been a lot more movement towards planning ahead. Okay. And what a lot of families don't realize is the, all the rules and regulations at the different cemeteries. So, for instance, if a family comes to us first, they will find out the type of memorial they can use at that cemetery, meaning is it flat, is it above the ground, is it a monument that's six foot high? Because cemeteries are like different cities. They have different rules and regulations. And the rules and regulations oh, wow. can change within the sections. Didn't even realize that, so that's yeah. very, very good to know. Uh, good to know. Okay, well, let's talk about uh, the number of different things that you have as far as religious gifts. I mean, uh, we actually have some on the on the table here, but we're also going to show what your showroom looks yes. like because it's a beautiful showroom, and there's uh, the beautiful building of Milano Monuments. Everyone knows it when they drive by. Well, within those walls, you'll, you'll find um, a you know, yard statue. So in May, if you want to come up with and have a nice Blessed Mother statue. Um, St. Anthony, whatever it may be, right. we probably have choices of, of 20 or 30 of those. Also, as the spring comes around, people are going to think about First Communion, and those are hard gifts to find, especially on a local basis where you right. can touch and feel them rather than buying them online. You'll find our price points to be very competitive with online, but where you can come in and physically see what we have and pick it out, and then you can always make an easy return if the gift doesn't work. Okay, and let's talk about the gifts that you actually have. Uh, and right there, we're showing CDs, but uh, the gifts that you have on the table here. Well, I brought today just the Holy Communion sets. Uh, we have um, the crucifixes for little boy and girl, rosaries for little boys and girls. And I just brought this in because so many families always say, geez, I didn't realize you had this stuff. Right. This is so hard to find because so many of these smaller religious gift stores have gone away. Right. And, and, and it's wonderful that you're actually helping the families, you know, kind of uh, get back to giving these wonderful religious gifts. Now, you, you've been on the show before talking about tributes.com. Uh, touch base on what exactly that is for people. Well, our family is very proud that we teamed up with Channel 3 to do what we call tributes, which is online obituaries. So really what a family can do, instead of, um, you know, just posting in the paper for a day or two, you can uh, put an online obituary up, whereas if something happens to a loved one, when that obituary is uploaded, you can email it to your entire address book. The pastor of your church can send it out to the whole congregation. Mm -hmm. But the price point is very reasonable. It's $35, and where the average newspaper today charges two to $300 to put an obituary in. So let's say you're on business out of town. You, you'll get a, a message on your PDA that so-and-so's father passed away. At least you could say, geez, I'm out of town. I'm sorry, I'm going to miss it, but you're in my prayers and thoughts. That really goes a long way for a lot of people. So, uh, you know, that's wonderful. I mean, not only you're reaching everybody, but economic, especially in these economic times, economically, it sounds like it's, it's a lot more feasible. And it's right there. I mean, you could put well, an instant future, message right Michael. there. for the Most people I talk to under 30 have never looked at a, at a newspaper. So in the future, it'll save families some money, but it'll be, you know, you won't be waiting till the next morning to get the information. You'll have it before 4 o'clock in the afternoon. All right. Well, Jim, thank you so much for, for coming on the show. So if you're looking for monuments or religious gifts or anything of that matter, please give Jim Milano at Milano Monuments a call at 800-626-7125, or you can go to their website for more information, milanomonuments.com. All right. We're going to send it over to the Fred with the Cleveland Men of Song. Boy, are they good. 